Drowning in a Vermont River for the second time in one week. Our Eichmann David has the latest on the search at Warren Falls. Crews not searching for the missing man on Monday, pointing to the conditions of rain, but also the conditions of the water here at Warren Falls. According to police, 35 year old Tuan Baldino of New Jersey was at Warren Falls with friends when he slipped while trying to cross the river. The pool that he fell into was uh, essentially white water. Um, and then there was a short fall, um, a waterfall down to another pool. Police say Baldino never resurfaced. Multiple rescue crews spent Saturday and Sunday working on the recovery mission, but suspended their search Monday because of the fast moving waters, shutting down the popular summer spot. With the amount of water that's going, um, flowing down the river, um, so it's just not safe for, for us to put a diver in the water. Rivers and swimming holes are a popular place for Vermonters and visitors in the summer. We ran into these teenagers on the trails on Monday. We just searched out the place and we thought we could just swim here and we didn't know it was going to be closed or anything. What State Police Captain Matt Daly says due to recent rain and flooding, some of the spots you think you know might have changed. The swimming hole that, that people feel comfortable, that have been there for 20 years, um, they, they don't know what's in there. I would caution anybody really from uh, going into those swimming holes at any point, probably this summer. Uh, it's just not a great idea until the water starts to recede. Captain Daly says they will reevaluate and come back to resume the search when conditions improve. In Warren, Ike Ben David, Channel 3 News.